What is up everyone? My name is Phil, the channel is Phil's Pulse, and we are back with another card opening video. Today's is gonna be a little bit different. Um, this was a very highly requested video that I do something like this, and I think I'm gonna make a little series um, out of it depending on how much stuff I can find. So this is uh, basically gonna be trying to pull my first card, or any of my first cards, which basically would come from um, most prospect stuff from 2004. So today we have 2004 Hot Prospects Draft Edition, um, which as you can see, was not an MLB uh, licensed product, so none of the uh, team logos are gonna be on there. As you can see on the box, my uh, former battery mate, Kurt Suzuki. Um, Kurt's still doing his thing with the Washington Nationals. Here he's a Oakland A's prospect, if you couldn't tell. Um, so yeah, so we're gonna, Crack this open. I think you get one autograph per box, so the odds of uh, getting my autograph in this are not very good, but um, we're gonna see what else we can find. And uh, yeah, have a little fun and try to pull my own baseball card or um, you know some cards of, of guys that I know or came up with or played against. So should be, uh, should be fun. A lot of you guys um, asked if I could uh, try to get my own cards and Believe it or not, packaged boxes from 2004, 15 years ago, are not the easiest to come by, but we were able to get this, and like I said, if I can find anything else, um, we'll make a little series out of this, and, um, and open those as well. So, how many packs we got here? Probably just could've read the thing, that would've been easier, 15. Um, and again, we got Kurt, there on the pack, and uh, yeah, we'll see what we can do. I know there are um, like multiple autographs. Like I think there's a card of mine you could get in here with like um, Mike Messina and Yogi Berra autographs on it, cool stuff like that. So first pack we got a Hank Blaylock, Griffey, Andrew Jones, some sort of cardboard thing, Kurt Schilling, and Jorge Posada. These things are super sticky. Very uh, hollow foil and all that fun kind of stuff. Uh, next pack, we got Craig Wilson, Ben Sheets, Joe Maurer, and we've got a jersey card here of Casey Kochman, Draft Rewind. It's kind of an interesting card. I don't remember these. Oh, and that's numbered to 113. Random number. Um, I don't, I was collecting um, back when this stuff came out, but I don't remember opening a lot of this. I've never been a fan of the uh, um, the cards without like team logos on them. And unfortunately with the prospects, that's like all they were. I don't know what these things are. Carlos Beltran, Jeter. So it appears as though the, the base cards are all kind of like veterans and stars. And then um, you got one like draft pick card here. Gagne, let's bring Thomas. Here we got a Brad Halsey. That's kind of like, oh, that's numbered to a thousand. It's got kind of that blue tint to it. Another filler, Jose Vidro, Carlos Delgado. Yeah, so like I said, I think it's one autograph per box. So again, the odds that it's my autograph aren't very good, but um, it'll be fun regardless to see who we pull. Todd Helton. Here we have a Nomar Garcia Parra and Sammy Sosa. Hot tandems. I forget Nomar even played for the Cubs. Lyle Overbay, Yvonne Rodriguez. If you guys would uh, be so kind as to leave a like on this video and all videos that you enjoy and subscribe. Let me know if you guys, here's a pudge to 150 red. Let me know if you guys would like to see me open some more stuff that has a possibility of finding my own card in it. Here we got a Matsui. 
Bill Cabrera, Rocco Baldelli, now manager of the Twins. And we got an Andy Pettit MLB Hot Materials Draft Edition jersey. Andy Pettit, and that is number two, 325. Put that over there. Troy Gloss and A-Rod. So I didn't even know that you could get a get like jerseys in this. I thought this was like a very prospect forward product, but apparently I'm wrong. Um, there's me doing my uh, no preparation going into these videos. Probably should hit up a checklist or something. And here's our autograph, and it is a Kyle Waldrop, the Minnesota Twins. I remember this name, um, but I, I don't recall exactly. That's the 299. Um, had a nice high school career, apparently. Yeah, not sure if you ever got to the big leagues, but Kyle Waldrop. There's your autograph. Uh, looks like we're not gonna hit on any of my cards in this box. And I'm pretty sure that's our only autograph for the box. We're kind of drawing dead, I guess you could say, with our last uh, last cards here. Here's a draft rewind, rewind. Ricky Weeks, Lyle Overbay, Pudge again. But I will try and get um, some more stuff. I've got um, some Bowman Sterling lined up. The Bowman draft picks and prospects is like just crazy base heavy. I'm not really trying to get too much into that. But if you guys know of any 2004 stuff that um, you would like to see me open up, feel free to leave a comment below. Let me know <clears throat> and I'll do my best to find it. eBay is usually the best, best resource, but I'll uh, try to find as much of this as I can. Chris Sains? to a thousand, it's that blue again. But yeah, not the easiest stuff to come by. I mean, it's been 15 years. It's kind of crazy to think about that, but I remember uh, collecting cards back, uh, back when this stuff came out and definitely does not seem like that long ago, but it seems like for the most part, everybody that was kind of a prospect coming up is either Done playing or kind of at the tail end, so it's crazy to think about. Time does fly. Bagwell, Tejada, two packs left. Kind of a bummer when we know we've already got our autograph and we're kind of Cleo Green, Mike Sweeney, Ichiro, youngish Ichiro. I think he was 2004, that was like his third year. 30 in the major leagues, he obviously played in Japan for a little bit before that, but. And Phillies, Jim Tomey, Kerry Wood. Here we've got a draft rewind, Kevin Brown. Kevin Brown with the Yankees, there you go. And Dontrell Willis, is that that blue or is that just, yeah, that's just the Marlins blue. And Vlad Guerrero, obviously the big card you get nowadays is his son. Aging myself a little bit, or aging him more than anyone, but anyways, hope you guys did enjoy. Uh, this is going to be the first of like kind of a little series, like I mentioned, where um, we open some older stuff and hope to pull a card that I am on. Not that that's the best financial decision, because those aren't um, exactly flying off the shelves these days, but fun nonetheless. Hope you guys did go on to enjoy. Um, leave a like, subscribe, all that good stuff, and I will see you guys later. That's it for me. See ya.